In this video, you're going to learn how to install SideQuest in just a few easy steps to unlock a whole new library of free games. Stick around. Hi guys, my name is Tony and welcome back to Jackal Dude Games. Today, I'm going to show you step by step how to install SideQuest, how to install games from SideQuest, and how to launch said games on your Oculus Quest or Quest 2. Trust me, it's super easy. All you need is your Quest, a phone, and a PC that has access to the internet. SideQuest has a bunch of free games and free features to unlock on your Quest. So if you have an Oculus Quest or Quest 2, you should be using SideQuest. Step one, you'll need to make a developer account. For this, you'll need to go to Oculus's developer dashboard, which I have a direct link to where you need to go in the description below. That link will take you to this page after you've logged in with your Oculus account. Here, you need to make an organization name for your developer account. This can literally be anything like, I don't know, poopy butts. Boobybots is already in. <laughs> Sweet. Hit I understand and then hit submit. And that's it. You've made a developer account. Step two, you'll need to install some ADB drivers from the Oculus website. If you have a Windows or Linux machine, you can skip this step entirely. But if you're running Windows, click the link I have down below take you directly to the drivers on Oculus's website. That will take you to this page. Here, just click I have read and agreed to the terms and download. You'll probably see something more like this. It'll be a zipped folder. So right click it and use 7-zip or RINRAR to rin, win, WinRAR. And then hit extract here or wherever you would like that. It's upset because I already have it. But once you've extracted, you'll hit this folder. From there, you'll go to USB driver, click on Android underscore win USB, right click and hit install. Operation complete. You have your drivers installed. Step three, you'll need to enable developer mode. For this, all you need is your phone and Oculus Quest to be connected to the same Wi-Fi network. Also, make sure your Oculus Quest is powered on. Now, once you've opened your Oculus app on your phone, head to Settings, and then find your Quest device and connect. Once connected, this drop-down menu should appear. Go to More Settings and find Developer Mode. And just make sure this is toggled on. And there you have it. Developer Mode is enabled. Now, we are almost done, but before we move on, I have to do the thing. So if this video was helpful at all, be sure to give it a thumbs up and think about subscribing for more in the future. I want to help you have more fun in VR. If that sounds good, hit the bell notification to always know when I post a video. Now, moving on to step four, connect your headset to your PC. For this, you can even use the USB power cable that your Oculus Quest 2 came with as long as your PC has a USB Type-C port. If it doesn't, I'll be sure to link you a USB Type-C to USB Type-A cable in the description below. Now, once you've physically connected your headset to your PC, pop your headset back on and you might get a prompt asking for permission for USB debugging. Click the box that says always allow for this computer. If you didn't get this prompt, it's probably because you've already done it at some point. Now, step five, install SideQuest. You'll need to install SideQuest from their official website, which I've linked to in the description below. That will bring up this menu. Make sure you download the right one for your operating system. Once loaded, hit the setup button down below. And only for me, everyone, doesn't really matter. Hit next and install it where you'd like. After that, hit finish and run SideQuest. Now, this page should show up in the top left corner. You should see a green light as well as some other information based on your device. If you don't see this, make sure you reset your Oculus Quest as well as replugging it in and then allowing permission to access this computer. 
But as long as that's green, you are now able to download games straight onto your quest. For example, let's do Hyperdash. Install to headset. Now to launch these games, go to your apps in the headset and in the drop down menu, go to unknown sources. This is where you will find all of your SideQuest downloaded games. SideQuest is an amazing tool, not just for its games, but all the other features it can unlock on your quest, such as wirelessly streaming VR games from your PC to your headset using virtual desktop, or changing the resolution of recorded clips on your quest. If you want to learn how to do that, make sure you're subscribed, as I will be making more videos going over all the games and features SideQuest has to offer. With that said and out of the way, thanks so much for watching and remember you're doing great and I'm proud of you.